Hey all, let's do a quick uh, lesson on uh, Play With Fire. Um, I think the low E, I think this is slightly, this is like E minus, I think it's slightly below standard, I think, because I just tuned up uh, to their studio recording. So I think it's slightly, maybe they slowed the tape down just a little, maybe it's the way it was engineered, maybe they were just too low that day, don't know. But there's your E. Tune from that. There's only uh, four chords in it. G, D, C, E minor. So G, D, C, and E minor, those are the only chords in it. And it comes down to this. Uh, that's, that's the riff of the song. Um, so you've got just an E minor underneath that. So let's go through it. Um, in terms of the picking pattern, I don't think he's doing it the same way all the way through, although there's little parts of that lick. That, that part is important. <laughs> the rest of it I don't think is quite as important, but figure out a picking pattern that makes sense for you. I again, I don't think Keith is doing it the same way each time through. But So you start with, it's in this E minor, it's in the key of E minor, but it starts in G. goes through after C. E minor to E minor 7. So it's just the B string of the third fret and the high E string of the third fret. That's it, right? Now how you pick that out, that's up to you. Now I don't think, uh, I assume that's Keith's guitar. I don't think he and Mick are doing exactly the same. Like the guitar is not following the vocal, the vocal is not quite following the uh, the guitar, but they're pretty close. And if you do da 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 something along those lines. Let's see if you see this hand. Figure out your own picking pattern, or what fingers you want to use. I probably, I might do them with the same finger. Figure, figure out your own way of doing that. Maybe both. That might be easier to press them both, even when you're only picking one. That's the whole thing. And then it's G, D, G, C, E minor. That's the whole two minutes. It's, it's only two minutes. It probably should be another minute long. And it doesn't do a... What it's missing is a middle eight that goes somewhere, you know? Like you want to A minor or do something. But it doesn't do that. It just stays with this. So you got this thing as the intro. And then the verses are all just on that E minor going to this. It just stays on that. Again, however you... 
Mm. However you choose to do that. You can listen to it and you can get it exactly like Keith does for the recording. I'm not going to do that. More power to it if you want to. Um, and then it just does between the verses. It goes back to the... And that's also the chorus. So then it'll go back to this. Before and between the verse. With no vocal. So it uses this as the chorus. And as the... Like the bridge between the verses. And that's the whole tune. In all its two minutes of glory. Good luck.